she was more than happy to do it. But I mean, she, gets, I'm like my old apartment. I kept pretty well clean. Uh, I'm kind of a clean freak. I'm I'm bad at dusting. I hate mm-hmm. that. So it was always kind of dusty. But I kept things picked up. But Baby J is a slob. Oh, I'll, she is. She is. This, there's clothes everywhere. She leaves her trash on the floor. So it it becomes a thing of I'm not cleaning up your mess. I'm just not. <laughs> and then she's like, Well, you know what? Neither am I. <laughs> so the mess just sits there. Until you find a pregnant lady for sixty dollars to come clean your house. The for pregnant days. woman came and cleaned our house. <laughs> and we were proud of it, damn it. <laughs> and we're keeping it clean now. So yes, yes, you come to the house now, it's clean. Because we keep it clean. Mm-hmm. But but all of this is the buildup. <laughs> <laughs> to me never wanting to mow my lawn because I don't want to do that. My life would be hell for you. I'd be like the seventh ring of hell for you. It, I'm sure it would be because you have a kid to take care of. That I don't want to do. And then I got to keep the house clean, which I hate doing, but it's it, that's easier the than. The hardest part of the house cleaning for me, though, is my menagerie of pets. Right. See, that's yeah, and that's another thing. Like our cat throws up all the time, and and if her box is full, she'll let us know by pooping in the floor, mm. right in front of us. Sometimes there was one day I was sitting in my chair, and I heard our cat meowing from the back room there. I was like, and she was kind of like howling. I'm like, what? What is it? And she's and she looked at me as I walked in, and then she turned around, walked away, and then turned back around, squatted and pooped in front of me. It was like, <laughs> hey, watch she this. You to know. Yeah, hey, watch this. You see this? <laughs> Go clean, clean my box. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm not even the one that cleans it. She's the one that cleans. It. I clean up the throw up. We we have we have yeah, chores you told there. Me you have ends. Yeah. You get the front end, she gets, she the, gets back the back end. end. So I don't know why she was telling me to go clean the box. <laughs> Screw you, Teebs. When she gets home, she'll clean it for you. I'm not cleaning it. Yeah, and then she'll just randomly throw up in the floor and all this. I mean, but we gotta clean that up. So it's you know, it's just a hassle. Plus, we have two floors. I just knock things around constantly. Do, that's what you do? No, my pets. There's not. Oh, things. knock things. Oh. Like, you'll put something on the table, and just all of it will be scattered across the floor. Yeah. Uh, she She's not bad for that. Um, she, she knows to kind of keep her nose out of things, although sometimes she gets curious and will jump up on a shelf and knock stuff over. And then I'll walk in. Like, I, she won't do it in front of me, but I'll walk in the room and be like, hmm, that was that. I know that wasn't in the floor at some point. <laughs> like, I know that was on a shelf. Yeah, my cats have no shame. Yeah. And there's just so much hair. And our, and our cat. Constant hair. Yeah. Like, our cat sheds, but it doesn't really, you don't really see it on your clothes too much. Mm-hmm. But if she lays somewhere often, you see it there. Like, there's a blanket she likes to lay on, and that's all you see on it now is fur. Everywhere. All the time. Yeah. No, just fur everywhere. It's yeah. all over my house. And that gets old. The but mattress. But you know what? She's like the least of our problems. Our problems are just, we just don't want to work the anymore. Trash. Yeah, we just don't want to work anymore. And, it, and again, it's not like we were spoiled like we did. Well, she might be. I don't think she had chores growing up. But like, I had chores growing up, and I know what I got to do. But then when it gets mixed in with her stuff, and it's like, so you made the mess, but I got to clean it up? Nah. And that's when I protest. And that's when it's like well, my house, power to the people. We didn't have chore chores. In the house. It was like you cleaned after yourself that, well everybody yeah. was cleaning after themselves then so everything got clean yeah there was no like chores and that's the rule i live by but it's hard to but you, you have to, it's hard to discern that ru- rule with garbage and dishes if you both use them so it's like you know and then again mm-hmm. we just kind of throw everything so it just it gets complicated like my brain <laughs> starts to hurt when i think about it so, so that's why we paid a pregnant woman to come clean it and now we'll never mess, mess it up again we promise <laughs> Keep it clean until she gets pregnant again, and then... Oh, yeah. No, if she needs more money, she can come by and vacuum or something. That's <laughs> fine. Like, I'm not saying boo to any of this. Send her my way. Yeah. But, no, that's we. That's why it was so clean last night when you came over is because we had it clean the week before, and we're, we're one week sober, so we're good. <laughs> one week sober? Yeah. Not throwing one things on the floor. That's right. Not throwing things in the floor. We got this. When I come to see Birdemic, yeah. you cannot give the pregnant lady cleaning house before I come. Okay, leave it the way it is. Okay. Yeah, so that yeah. I can judge right. if you've stayed sober. Or That's not. the thing. Yeah, it's like that show Hoarders. Like mm-hmm. they, they clean the house, it looks great, and then they come back four or five months later to it's see. It's like all hoarded again. It's hoarded or it's starting to get hoarded or something. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's the thing. That's the key. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> 
we'll see if we can surprise you. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. I don't know if that's a thing, but we'll see if we can do it. Yeah, she just has to tell me uh, pregnant lady to not come by and be like, this is amazing. Uh, if we can just keep it clean. Or I'll just be like, she didn't come, did she? No, she, she did. You couldn't get the pregnant lady to come <laughs> back, could you? No. No. <laughs> Our shame got the better of us. It did. It did. <laughs> But no, yeah, like if we ever get a house, she's she is in agreement. We're just gonna pay somebody to come mow our lawn. Yeah. Even if it's just a little square outside of a house, a tiny house. So mine would be a hundred dollars a week. Hundred dollars to have a half acre, <sighs> front and backyard. So Jesus. that's just too much. No, that's way too much. I mean, at that rate, I can pay off my no interest lawnmower in a year of paying people to mow my yeah, lawn. Yeah, that's a much better deal. So, and then I get like 15 years out of it, kind of. So, yeah. So there you go. Point taken. Come work for me. Don't work for Sheila. She won't, she won't pay you because she's, she's got, a, she's got stuff. Don't worry about it. Yeah. I don't have anything. Come work I for me. I will pay someone to come in every other day just to vacuum up the pet hair. That bad? I it just it well you have grows. cats and dogs yeah it just and grows to where like you sweep and then literally thirty minutes later you start to see the tumbleweeds forming again. yeah yeah our friend Stephanie who was here last week she's got two dogs and that's mm-hmm. the same thing she vacuums then they get down walk mm-hmm. and then oh look more fur yeah like it's not even they're not even like shedding it's just oh look more fur and then like the cats all have this like fur droppings it's just so much fur. And then if there's any place that one of the cats lay, all the cats lay. Mm -hmm. And so it just becomes its own cat. (laughs) It's like this multicolored cat. Yeah. Well, that's all right. You know, that 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 might have to happen. Like, I think I don't, I don't know if I can fix my son's pea coat. Oh, so you can't let him stay on that at all. It was like that wool. Yeah. And I just I have no idea how to get all the fur off of it. Right. Yeah. I didn't allow any cats to get it because I had a pea coat. I can't fit it anymore because I'm fat. But uh, back when I had it, I didn't I didn't allow any cats near it because mm-hmm. yeah, you can't get stuff out of that. It's impossible. Yeah, I'm like I don't know how to do this. this no. is, the the roller cannot handle this job. No, it's it's too much. It's too much. Now I'm just depressed myself talking about cleaning 